The alkanes are a family of organic compounds that consist of just carbon and hydrogen atoms, linked together by single covalent bonds, having their chemical or molecular formula Cn H2n plus 2, where n is a positive integer. So to take the simplest example, when n is 1, you get a compound with molecular formula CH4, which is given the name methane. The meth prefix tells you there is a chain of just one carbon atom, and the ane ending tells you it is an alkane. Ethane is the alkane with a chain of two carbons, propane 3, butane 4, pentane 5, and so on. In principle, there is no reason why this series, called a homologous series, could not be continued indefinitely. Each time a carbon atom is added to the chain, two extra hydrogens are also added, to produce compounds with much higher molecular masses. Crude oil, which is a major natural source of many alkanes, contains alkanes with chains of up to 70 carbon atoms. When the carbon atoms are linked together in a single chain, you get straight chain or linear alkanes. This isn't to say these compounds are literally straight. The arrangement of atoms around a carbon atom that has four single covalent bonds is tetrahedral, producing molecules whose carbon backbone is zigzag or snake-like in shape rather than straight. At room temperature and pressure, the alkanes from methane up to butane are gases, so tend to be sourced from natural gas rather than crude oil. The mid-length alkanes in crude oil are liquids, and very long chain alkanes waxy solids. The boiling points of alkanes increases with the length of the carbon chains. This is because dispersion forces of attraction between nonpolar alkane molecules increase as the size of the molecules increases. Similarly, longer chain alkanes are more viscous or thicker liquids, as longer molecules tend to become entangled with each other like strands of spaghetti. A fractionating column uses these differences in physical properties to separate out the different alkane components from the mixtures that occur in natural gas and crude oil. Upon heating, the lighter, more volatile, shorter length alkanes move up the column further, while the heavier, longer chain alkanes stay at the bottom. Alkanes do not have to be comprised of a single chain of carbon atoms. Consider butane, which has four carbon atoms and ten hydrogen atoms. There are two molecular structures consistent with this molecular formula. One is the straight chain molecule, known as N-butane, and the other a branched molecule, commonly called isobutane. These two molecules are structural isomers, or molecules with the same molecular formula, but different molecular structures.